Welcome back to The People Show. I'm your host, Ed Ribon, on Public Access Television. I'm over here at Johnny Appleseed Park on the actual boat access we have, legitimate boat access we have, but it's only for about a couple miles where um, we would have the raft race uh, for the Three Rivers Festival. This would be the start of it. We'd go um, on the river up here and wind around by Northside High School and finish up on Tennessee Bridge. And uh, contestants try to get over uh, by um, the old fort and try to salvage their rafts or what uh, and stuff like that. But uh, this is the only boat access we have legitimate. Over here, my right, your your left is the another dam where just a um, few episodes back we we filmed over on on uh, North Anthony over there where we had the debris and all that. That's going to cause a problem, and the engineers we, we better start cleaning that up. Um, even if we have a hard freeze or, you know, you never know with Indiana weather, uh, we could flood. You know, I don't want to see that happen, but we got to be ahead and not behind. And it seems like Fort Wayne is always behind and we don't even uh, worry about little details. And we want to build an, another apartment complex at Headwaters Park on a floodplain zone is ridiculous. We're still, uh, we're digging into that next. Uh, and figuring that out. I don't know why Wayne TV or even the local media had not you know, did their fact finding about that floodplain zone. Because I do remember the flood of 1978. I'm sure you do, or the flood of 82 when President Reagan was here. And I was just over there on Anthony. Uh, could you imagine, you know, that dam goes out or whatever, all that neighborhood over there gets destroyed, flooded, you know? And we can't have that. We need to think down the road <laughs> of that kind of uh, nature, you never, yeah, we can't uh, forecast that, but we, let's at least be prepared and let's not, and, and do our due diligence for the people. And that's what I'm all about when I run for, for mayor. And I'm standing out here in the middle of a cold day, you know, for the people, you know, uh, and, and I appreciate the followers and, and I'm waiting, you know, March 1st is when we open uh, back up with the food truck, uh, you know, and, Ides of March, I'm looking forward to a good March, you know, birthday week in March 19th. Uh, we're uh, March 29th, Dragon Force is coming to Pierre's. Dude's a stoked uh, guitarist. He's as badass as Eddie Van Halen. Pierre's got that uh, Dragon Force booked. You don't know who that is. I don't know if you played uh, Guitar Hero when you're a young kid and all that. That was the band, man. They're a badass. Uh, Hermes, uh, he's going to bring like 200 guitars, I guarantee it. So when we uh, get back uh, on track about why we're here um, at Lawton Park uh, segment, I want to make that into a legitimate boat access. We have boat access here, but lo and behold, we can have people come here or be on downtown and be able to park their boat and, and be able to go down to Headwaters Park or maybe go down to the restaurants and it'll be an another avenue of people trying to go downtown. And I think we need to develop a better use of our rivers. This would be a key element on the Lawton Park a project. We can expand on that and help out Tim Hall and, and the rest of the uh, Club Soda people. You're killing him uh, with that construction. I just don't know if you guys realize that to the small business owner uh, when construction is never good for the people. Their, their sales go down, way down. Now there's no parking for the individual, more people who work downtown. So you just made it more of an, uh, um, uh, an implosion is what I'm calling it. <laughs> just blowing up the city. Uh, we still have a sewage problem, the council win, and, and our trash problem, which you spent two hours last week at city council about sidewalks, which don't get me wrong, we need to have uh, better side, sidewalks for our, our community and for um, better, uh, neighborhoods need, uh, even the south side is getting neglected on, on the sidewalks and we can't forget our trash problem. Let's get back to that city council. Let's figure our trash problem, move one problem and fix that and try to figure out what you're doing and not be complacent. And then you didn't even vote on the sidewalks. We got to come back in a couple of weeks to talk about it. So you do that on every single big time, uh, you like filibuster the whole evening about sidewalks. And when it came down to the vote, you didn't even come up, you know, we need to come back to the people, you know? So uh, every time, you know? Um, so when we come back, we're still hitting hard. Uh, uh, I heard Legacy Fund money for the Three Rivers Open Air Music Festival. 
We're talking to the committee people. Oh yeah, we're wrestling feathers people. It's for you guys. Couple, couple, 10,000 people every day downtown. Let's bring it for the people. So when we come back, we'll go to another spot in Fort Wayne, talk about it. So go get some hot chocolate, because I am going to stop over at McDonald's. We all need a break, don't we? Copy. <laughs>